Now I'm going to show you three ways to create a print screen on a MacBook and this should work on any MacBook. I'm using a MacBook Air. Now if you previously owned a Windows computer you'll know that there was a dedicated print screen button on the keyboard which is great but Apple likes to do things a bit different, a bit more complicated and hence the reason for this video. So without further ado let's get started. And the first method to capture the entire screen is to press the three keys, shift, command, and the number three together. And you can press them in the order, shift, command, then three, or command, shift, and three, but it won't work if you press three first. And then release those keys, and you should see the screenshot appear on the bottom left-hand side of your desktop. And if you're quick, you can grab that snapshot with your cursor and move it to a folder or document of your liking. Otherwise, it will remain on the desktop. The second method is if you want to take a screenshot of a portion of your screen and you can do this by holding the three keys shift command and the number four together and then your mouse pointer will turn into a crosshair so then you can drag your crosshair to select the area of the screen that you want to capture and then release the mouse to take the screenshot i can drag it or just leave it on the desktop so if i just open that up you can see it's now this is a portion of that screen from on the left hand side there. And the third way is if you want to capture a screenshot of a window. And here again, you would press and release the three keys, shift command and the number four. And then, but then when you get the crosshair, press the space bar and then your pointer will change to a camera icon. And then you just have to move the camera icon over the window you want to capture and then click to take the screenshot. If I go for this one. There, then it's taken a screenshot. Now the problem you get when it saves your screenshots to your desktop is it can get crowded because I don't know about yourself, but I tend to have a lot of folders and files on my desktop because it's the easier way just to save them. And when you and when you're taking screenshots as well, and I tend to take quite a few screenshots, it just adds to the problem. And then it's difficult to find them because it just places them randomly all over the desktop. So the way around that is that you can actually save these screenshots to the clipboard. And the way you do this is by pressing down the control button when you use the shortcuts that I've previously shown you. For example, for the first method, you would press and hold down control, shift, command, and three. And then for the second method, you would hold control, shift, command, and four. And then that will copy the screenshot to your clipboard so you can paste it into a document as I'm doing here and I'm just using the control V to paste it into this document on the right as you can see here. Now if you've got a Windows computer it does that automatically for you just by pressing the print screen button but that's Apple for you. And if this video has helped you out please thumbs it up, share and subscribe for more videos to come and thanks for watching.